Oh, no, I know. Thank you. Yeah, I'm not going to mess it up. All right. Hey, it's time to check in with Bob. Hey, Bob, I heard you're out there uh, spreading good cheer yet again. How are you, my friend? Yeah, guy. Wow. <laughs> Aren't you just drunk with holiday spirit? How are you, ladies and gentlemen? That's right. I'm out here at Universal Orlando today. And, Guy, we were just talking. When's the last time you got a gift that you actually needed? Uh, that's going to take some time, Bob. I can't go back that far. Problem is, it's been a while, right, Guy? Help a me long out here, time, brother. Bob. A long time. That's the problem. Nobody gives gifts out that people need. They only give gifts out to what people want. So I'm walking around the park today with my uh, <laughs> lovely elf, Jamie. And we're giving out uh, presents that kids of today really need, like this young man. Come here, young man. How are you? Ho, ho, ho. Merry non-specific religious holiday to you. Come here, young man, right here. Here's a problem with the kids of today. All they eat is junk food, and thus they fill their bodies with sugars and trans fats. That's why Santa Bob has the solution. That's right, young man. Put your hands out. It's frozen peas. There you go. Frozen peas for you. Ho, ho, ho. Merry non-specific religious holiday to you. There you go, sir. There you go. There you go sir. Frozen peas. There you go, sir. Frozen peas. How are you? How are you? Come here. You young man, come right over here. Here's the problem with most teenagers of today. They're disgruntled and anti-establishment. You know why? Because all they listen to is death rock. If you listen to Death Rock, you'd probably set fire to bus stop trash cans and household cats also. That's why we have the solution. Where are you, elf? Uh, that's right. Merry, happy non-specific religious holiday with your Yanny CD. That's right, a, a Yanny CD. After all, what calms kids down more than the thin-bearded Grecian superstar, Yanni? There you go. Take that. Enjoy it. Anti-establishment teen right there. How you doing? You right there, young man. Come here. How are you? Nice to see you. Ho, ho, ho. Happy non-specific religious holiday to you. What we have here is a classic example of kids of today wearing their shorts way too baggy. But don't worry. Santa Bob has the solution. It's called suspenders. <laughs> So what I need for you to do is to just strap that on right there. And you know what? The segment's only three minutes. There we go. Hard to believe we buried this segment in the fourth block, isn't it? Hi. How are you? Got some beautiful teenage girls here. Here, here some, let, me, let me toss some more peas out to the crowd. Here you go. There you go. Give that to the fat guy. There you go. Need some more peas. Okay. The girls of today with their internet social networks such as MySpace, Friendster, Facebook, you know, it's a great way to meet people, but quite honestly, it's sort of impersonal. That's why Santa Bob has the solution. A great way to meet people that's a lot more personal, and it always worked when I was a kid. That's right. It's the can connected by shoestring. Watch. Watch how it works. Will you be my friend? There you go. Merry non-specific religious holiday to you. There you go. Have some peas, too, because I think I've played that bit out. Got anyone else? Here, you, sir, right here. Right here. See, the problem with a lot of kids today, they, they spend a lot of time playing uh, handheld uh, entertainment devices. That's right. I don't know what you just said. Don't curse. We're live. But the problem is that they're not very educational. That's all right, because Santa Bob has exactly the handheld entertainment device that's also edu educational. It's, it's multiplication flashcards, ladies and gentlemen. Multiplication flashcards. What do you say? Thank you. Thank you, sir. There you go. All right. It's thank you, sir. You would have learned that if you read your book of etiquette. There you go. <laughs> happy non-specific religious holiday. All right. There you go. My elf and I say happy non-specific religious holiday to you. Back to you guys right. in the studio, Namwa. Well, Wait. Bob, I have to say that in the chat rooms, um, some people do approve of your merry non-specific holiday, like pink lipstick. She likes that, but they have some issues with your uh, costume there. Bella says, does he know his beard is not even on his face? Why? I don't, I don't, oh, my beard, yeah. Your beard well, is a little low. If you, if you could smell the beard, you'd realize why it wasn't on my face either. I think we rented it from a dung farm. True. Happy non-specific religious holiday to you. Thank you both. You too.
to you, sissy. All right, can't top that. Thank you so much, Nanwa. Well, coming up next, we are getting lucky, Adam, because it's a New Year's feast that will take your breath away. This is Adam, our young producer in training, and here's your first job. You ready? Take it away. You're watching I Village Live. Yeah. Yeah.